okay so how do we go about recovering uh, the OCR well there are three options over here well there are three possible options the first one is that the export dump file that we created the second is the OS level backup we have done the third one is the auto backups that are created by the CRS so let's look at the restoring the auto backup yeah for some reason when your OCR is unavailable it does not show you uh, the backup location anymore but since we know what the backup location is let's go there let's go to your CRS home see data the CRS name is the CRS okay so let us restore for the from the most latest backup over here syntaxes the location and then the file name so the command looks like it succeeded but did it actually succeed so let's do an this and you see an return code 26 which is not normal if the command would have completed successfully you would have had uh, the return code as 0 so let's go back to the OCR location and as you can see that there are no files that have been restored now why is that why did the OCR config did n uh, not throw up any error why did it just come out well um, to examine why it did that what we need to do is you know why the OCR files have not been restored we go to the home location the log directory and here go to the client directory this client directory the log location for inside the uh, log folder you have the client directory which actually gives you the uh, which uh, any command that you uh, run over here from the command line mostly the OCR config OCR check etc it dumps any errors that it finds in this location so we go over here now view this file it says fail to open OCR so and so so it looks like it's again expecting these two files to be existing at the OS level so let's go ahead and create it and let's rerun the same command the restore command now yeah I'm too lazy to type it again okay so the command completed the result code is now zero that means it completed normally Now we see these two files being restored. Well, I have one question unanswered. Why is the size different? 
I still have not been able to figure it out but then your OCR um, now let's do an OCR check and verify the integrity of these files okay it says the integrity check succeeded for both the files and then I bring up the CRS now okay I check the check no errors this time so we expect the CRS to be up this time let's check the stats of the CRS now, um, I have uh, for training purpose I shut down the other node so like you can see over here we are dealing with the train2 server so all the services or resources on the train2 have come up successfully so so we were able to successfully restore from the auto backup that was generated now let's uh, simulate the uh, same error and try to restore from the um, the export file or the OS level copy the OS level copy is pretty simple so I'm not going to deal with that so let's check the export now I shut down the CRS again okay now Just remove it because I don't have enough. Or well, let me remove the old one. okay so you're back to generating the same uh, situation here that the server rebooted for some reason and we have lost all the OCR disks over here now the method that we are going to try over here is the uh, export so again I'll just try to start the CRS and it's going to fail because it does not see the OCR disk Now we had taken the backup in the slash TMP location. Now you see that in the export is taken here. okay we got an error here so this does not give us much information let's have a look at the log file again
and I fire the backup, the import again. Data zero. We have the backups restored. Doing CRS CTL start CRS, and your CRS should be up as normal. 